Hi, welcome back. And I wanted to put this video together quite quickly because um, hopefully it will help quite a few people. So a lot of people have been looking for FPS gains in Assetto Corsa Evo, and for good reason. The uh, engine itself is clearly not yet optimised. That's no surprise given its very early access. Um, now, I've been doing what a lot of people have been doing, which is um, lowering the resolution in-game. Now, uh, I've got a TV monitor or a TV screen on my rig. It's a 4K screen, and I'd basically, in-game, uh, whack that down to 4 1440p. The problem with the current build is you have to keep going in um, every time you launch to a new track and resetting the in-game resolution because it defaults to native. And I mentioned this on uh, my first look video and I had a comment from um, a viewer called Todd McDonough, uh, McDonough I, I think that's your name Todd, I apologise if I've just butchered that, who said that what they've done is go into the um, actual monitor settings, well, Windows um, display options, and force the screen to 1440p, because it saved a lot of switching. And I thought I'd give that a go, but I have a nice um, ASD habit of every time I make a graphical change, I have to see what the uh, performance impact on it is. And I didn't expect a great deal. And boy, was I surprised. Um, this current build of the game really does like native resolution. I mean, really does. So what I've been showing on screen here is the difference between these two, where basically you're looking at what... Um, <clears throat> what frame rate you're getting when you are running at your monitors or screens native resolution and then you're changing it in game so in my case you've got 4k at the screen and then 1440p in game forced and that gave me around brands hatch with a single car frame rate of between 53 and 72 fps the other is then um same car, same track, same time, same everything, apart from I'd gone into Windows um, display settings and forced the monitor to uh, 1440p and then just used the native resolution in-game for that. Uh, and that basically gave me a frame rate of 90 to 120. Now, that is, quite frankly, a huge boost. That's almost double in this case. And keep in mind, these are running on ultra settings um, on my GPU's A, um, RTX 4070. Uh, there is a bit of DLSS uh, thrown in here as well, but this is a significant difference. It's made a huge difference for me. Um, if you're running something a little less than the 4070 I've got, you can always change from ultra down to high or even medium settings, but this for me gives a massive amount of room. Now, if you are already running at an optimal um, display resolution this unfortunately is not going to help you and my apologies for that uh, but for those of you who are not running at your monitor or screen's native resolution and you're lowering the resolution if you go down this route give it a go it won't hurt but hopefully you should see at least some gains whether you get as much of a gain as I am I don't know but it is a big gain that we're getting here okay so that's a quick one if you found this useful please do give it a thumbs up if you want to see more content Content like this please do like and subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to be notified when new content gets uploaded thanks very much everyone take care bye